You are watching the most valuable player in the NBA, Buffalo's Bob McAdoo. Tonight, McAdoo challenges Washington. Elvin Hayes, the Big E, has scored 60 points in the last two playoff games as the Bullets have opened up a 2-1 edge on the Braves. Welcome to the Memorial Auditorium in Buffalo and Game 4 of the Eastern Conference Semi-Final Series between the Buffalo Braves and the Washington Bullets. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brent Musburger, along with Oscar Robertson. And, Oscar, whenever we come to Buffalo, we've got to start with a big guy off the top, Bob McAdoo. What a series he's had so far. Yes, he has, Brent. He's averaging around 35 points a game right now. And I was talking to Coach Jones before the game. He's going to try something new this game. He's going to try four different players on McAdoo doing the ball game. Anselm, who can be very physical, the top right on your screen, it, if he wants to do the best physical job, I should say. On the right. There are the lineups, no surprises, and no injuries with those starting five. Little man, and that 24-second shot clock winds down. Shot is missed. Smith with a rebound. A gimme. Hurt. Back down by Garfield Hurd to Charles. Randy Smith in the middle. Loses control against Porter, but it's regained by Buffalo. Oh, you see that move then? Hey, wow. What a move he put on Hunter that time. Inside, a little high. Yep. Did Garfield Hurd play good defense, good position then. Back comes McAdoo. Great lane. Play to set it up very well. Good movement that time, Oscar. Yes, it was. Right back is McAdoo, and this is the third year in the M NBA. Started out as Rookie of the Year, then runner-up for the Most Valuable Player and MVP this year for McAdoo. It's 21-18. Washington leads 138. Phil Chenier tries to pass it in to Unsell, who is rolling. Knocked away. Here's Winfield for Buffalo. Over here to McAdoo. Got that soft touch and rolled it right in. McAdoo is 11. Garfield Hurd, 24. Waits for Mara. Now he goes the other way. Jump shot, McAdoo. So it is the second of those four defenders against Bob McAdoo. This time it's Wesley Unsell. And his crowd comes alive. They sense that the team might make a move. Smith. Sickles get somebody out there. It's McAdoo. Well, I'll tell you what, the crowd sensed that. You can't let that young man get his hands on the ball. And Robinson is in the game now for Elvin Hayes. He's a rookie. He just oh, pushed down back to it. Knock it in. And there's a whistle. Down to the one. And he got to win this game. Four-point Washington lead. Basketball. It's 50-42. Now Witherspoon is guarding McAdoo. There's the third man on him. McAdoo shoots four. Witherspoon. He doesn't, he doesn't care who guards him. He's going to put it in. 54 to 44. Kenny Charles has checked back into the lineup, and so is Jimmy Washington. And Koselko's in now guarding Elvin Hayes. Everybody gets a break. McAdoo. I should say Elvin Hayes and Koselko were guarding McAdoo, but they didn't do any good. McAdoo has 19 first half points in his club. Rod says, come on, keep like, this, is, this is smart basketball. McAdoo. They have 20 before the end of the game. There's a whistle. If you jump one of them, he's sitting over there. He doesn't need more time. <laughs> McAdoo at the line. Sunny Hill. Bob McAdoo was out there picking up some hardware. The most valuable player in the NBA, Simon Gordine, the deputy commissioner of the NBA, was here to make the presentation. Simon there on the left, McAdoo on the right. Now that plaque that Simon is holding is given to McAdoo for having won the scoring championship. I hope you enjoy it. It's with our blessing. McAdoo received about four standing ovations during that ceremony. Sonny, who votes for that award as the MVP? That's the vote player. that's held by the players in the league, and Bob McAdoo made a very nice comment after receiving it. He felt that it was an this indication award, from his peers how much they much thought of him by selecting you. him. Washington leads. They lead the series 2-1. Here is Kenny Charles bringing it down. McAdoo with 20 points in the first half. Make it 22. McGee, something to watch. 
So he was not fouled in the act of shooting either. And they're not in a penalty situation, so they take it out of bounds, and McAdoo says, let me have it. Reardon trying to set yeah, up the play. He wants to pick, and he goes the other way. Doesn't get it in. Down comes Charles. Buffalo getting to that basket. McAdoo. Melvin Hayes waits for the little man who was going to set it up. I think I'll have to just do a swing gum over here. Hold on. Porter fouled him oh. when he came back. What a talent. Big back. There's Ernie DiGregorio. <laughs> hey, Ernie, Wake stick up. with us. Don't fall asleep now. What a time to cut to a picture of him. Have a squat formation here with his free throws. You know, talking about rebounds, McAdoo's picked off six so far in this quarter. Make it seven. Charles regains control. Landy Smith with a good fake. McAdoo, eight rebounds this quarter. Goes in. Yeah, good. Took his time and knocked it in. 3.09 to go in the third quarter. McAdoo. That's 33 points for the MVP. And Jimmy McMillan is taking some shots. McAdoo with a rebound. Pounded it right in there. Got it in. Charles comes into the right corner. I'm not doing the drive. Okay. Comes to Hayes. Heard on him. Now they come back. Oh, the jump shot. And again, it's McAdoo. Oh, Shadier he... misses his first one. A full deal for Washington. Here's Smith. about that fifth foul because he has it now anyway. He fouls out, let him foul out being positive out there. 9.46 for the game when Hayes picked up his fifth. Knock it out. No, I think he'll move man, Brent. Here's Smith. They hope he gets hot. Battle for the boards and Buffalo is taking charge. So gives it back. Chenier blocked by McAdoo. Here's Charles. Scored only two points. Starfield hurt. McAdoo. That time. Washington. Oh, I mean, oh, oh, hey. Twice. I think Wax doubled. Oh, Mac. Mac. He's in there. He's up high. Too high for Wesley Alco. That's 43 points for Bob McAtee. Garfield uh, hurt. That was out a little too far for Sure is. Yes, they are. Hurd tries to go inside of McAdoo. Yes, it gets there. Speaking of that game down in Landover, some of the Washington Bullets officials told me they've got tickets still available. Uh, McAdoo. And that makes 49 points for McAdoo. That's what you really can in a game like this, but that guy's really been super. There's Randy Smith. That's goodbye, Bullets. Yes, it is. 72-70 at the end of the third. Well, McAdoo right now, he's shooting again. 54, great, they love it. That's a half a hundred. And McAdoo gets
gets a standing ovation and well deserves it. Jones here to Reardon. That's it. It's all over. It's two and two now, Fred. Well, they go back to land on their own. I'll tell you, I'd hate to be taking on the Washington Bullets after this loss.